hello all welcome to the channel this is d square and today i'm gonna show you how to make a pressure simulation in uh, solidworks so here you can see that uh, i have a pressure vessel so today i will make a pressure simulation so first uh, click here simulation tab and get here new study for this one click here static and click right here uh, first need to apply the material so right click here and apply material for this vessel i am applying yellow steel apply and close okay fine material is applied successfully now fixture right click here and get here fixed geometry so these two are uh, to one face and the second face these two faces are fixed during the simulation. Now click right. Apply load here. Right click and here get here the pressure. So for that uh, I'm using unit is a mega pascal and my pressure value is uh, 9 mega pascal. And uh, here uh, just click here ID face. So here we are getting OD face only for that uh, right click and select other here you can get the ID of the vessel once more here right click select other and here you can get the ID of the vessel once more right click select other ok here ID here you can see the one line is generated so this all ID faces are selected now right here and uh, run the simulation ok meshing is completed ok fine we have the result here you can see the deformation scale is uh, 82 it is uh, scale so get here setting first uh, chart option click here so minimum and maximum annotation may scientific to floating for uh, this type of letter format and uh, definition in get here mega pascal and select this one true scale now right okay fine here we have one gem one scale okay here you can see that my yield limit is a uh, 620 and uh, my maximum pressure is a uh, 640 here it means uh, for a uh, 9 megapascal pressure this uh, pressure vessel will blast or i can say it will fail now displacement right click setting and uh, get here true scale ok fine and once more uh, get here a floating number ok so here you can see that here is my maximum displacement is uh, 0.190 mm ok so we are just animated what happened in reality for that I am making more frame per second now click right okay here you can see that the animation okay just click right and i just want to see what is my factor of safety so this is defined factor of safety plot now click right okay here you can see that my factor of safety is uh, point 97 it means uh, in uh, reality my factor of safety is should be more than one right it uh, has to be two or three it should be more than one so for this one this is not a safe design setting and uh, get the letter in floating okay fine here you can see where is here my actual factor of safety so what i can do so my for that uh, i can do is uh, 
apply low pressure or uh, I have to change the design or the material for that uh, my material and design is fixed so I can do only one thing that is uh, apply less pressure right click here and edit definition I am applying pressure value is uh, 5 megapascal okay right now run this study again okay fine here we have the result here you can see yield strength is uh, 620 that is fixed okay now here you can see my maximum pressure is uh, 355.656 it means uh, for uh, 5 megapascal pressure this uh, vessel is uh, safe it won't fail or won't blast okay so just check your displacement here you can see the displacement value is uh, 0.106 mm it will displace only point uh, 106 mm and here strain this is my scale result here so double click here and uh, get here true scale in chart option and get this one is uh, floating now click right so this is my strain where uh, where is the atom will change their shape so so here you can see uh, section clipping and uh, right now I'm selecting a different plane right click and clear this one I am selecting the right okay so here you can see that inside this uh, orange color shows the maximum strain it means uh, here uh, maximum atoms will change their shape so this is my strain now right click here and uh, no need to setting just uh, right click and section clipping in downside you can get uh, this one clipping of the off okay done here okay now what is my factor of safety here you can see that my factor of safety is uh, 1.744 it is uh, more than one so i can say this is a safe design for a uh, 5 megapascal pressure only if uh, my pressure will increase so factor of safety will also decrease and uh, it has a chance to be fail okay so this is the how we can make a pressure simulation in solidworks if you want to compare all results so click here compare result and here you can choose which one you want to compare so we are comparing all result okay click right here here you can see that four window right so first one is stress second one is displacement third is a strain and fourth is a factor of safety you can compare all result in one display okay if you want to save the image you can click here and you can save it now exit compare okay so this is the how we can make a pressure study Okay, so thank you for watching the video.